It is learned from Vedic literature that, of course, they are showing us Lord Shiva, Lord Brahma. They are also sometimes attracted by sense objects. Just like uh, Lord Brahma, he, his daughter Saraswati, Saraswati is considered to be the uh, most perfect form of beauty, womanly beauty, Saraswati. So, Lord Brahma became enchanted by the beauty of his daughter. Just to show us the example, that even personalities like Lord Brahma sometimes become enchanted. This Maya is so strong. Uh, he forgot that she is my daughter. Uh, then to penance this, Brahma had to quit the body. These stories are there in the Srimad Bhagavad. Similarly, Lord Shiva also, when Krishna appeared before him in Mohini Murti, Mohini Murti, Mohini means the most enchanting, beautiful, womanly form, Lord Shiva also became mad after her. So, wherever she was going, Lord Shiva was chasing. And it is stated that uh, while chasing Mahini Murti, uh, Lord Shiva had discharged. 
So, these examples are there. As it is stated in the Bhagavad Gita, Devidhisa Gunamai Mamamaya Duratya. The whole material energy is enchanting every one of us by this beauty, the womanly beauty. Actually, there is no beauty. It is illusion. Sankaracharya says that you are after this beauty, but have you analyzed this beauty? What is the beauty? It is the wrong. Rakta mangsa vikaram. It is just like uh, our student Govinda Dasi and Naranara and molding plaster of Paris. Uh, at, at, at this time there is no attraction. But this plaster of Paris, when it will be nicely painted, it will be so attractive. Similarly, this body is combination of blood and muscles and veins. If you cut the upper portion of your body as soon as you see inside, it is all obnoxious, horrible thing. But outwardly so painted by the illusory color of Maya, oh, it is very attractive. And that is attracting our senses. This is the cause of our bondage. Hare Krishna, Hare Krishna, Krishna Krishna.